Hello everyone. Okay, so in this video, I would like to talk to you about my TM Caruana award system. Okay, so this is obviously just a system that I keep for fun because I love reading books, I like reviewing books and I like to know, uh, to compare them all and to tell you what I thought about them in a measurable um, award system, to give them a badge of my own. And because I don't think that the five star uh, award system is uh, comprehensive enough just for my own pleasure uh, obviously when I review it on, on other platforms I will use those systems uh, but um, I want to analyze it more in detail uh, so, so I have created four categories so I am reviewing the uh, message or the moral me moral you know ethical message of the book um, I will review the uh, um, environment and creatures, so the the building of the pers the characters and or, or the the animals or whatever creatures there is in the books, because obviously I mostly do fantasy, so it could be just anything. Uh, and then I review the uh, captivity or or continuity. So uh, if I was you know wanting to turn the pages and and it was intriguing and the story evolved uh, and the twists were you know, in intriguing, um, and uh, then the fourth uh, category that I want to review is uh, the uh, language, and I'm not talking about grammars or, or sentences or how you structure your, your chapters and things like that, because I'm not perfect with that either in my book, so uh, it's more of when I read it, did, was it too confusing, was it maybe uh, repetitive or was it um, that you, you you know maybe words that was too complicated for me because obviously this is my award my badges so uh, I'm just talking from me so this is obviously my opinions and and my opinions is leaned more to more towards epic fantasy or fantasy paranormal romance and um, urban fantasy sci-fi and you know romance elements I, I like um, when something is, you know, you can't see something and then you like realize something happened that it's twists and turns in the story that there's a lot of world building characters and imagination and things like that so obviously all of this will be built uh, on my opinions uh, um, alone so obviously this is not an official badge system or award system that's registered anywhere and, and anything it's just, just me making it up so uh, it's just for fun um, and so the language will just be if if I felt like I could get through it or if I was uh, you know not really sure what's going on and things like that so uh, and and sometimes uh, the language can be very uh, classical traditional with uh, quotes and and cl clever wits and things like that and funny humor maybe that I find it's intriguing so that is sort of what that section uh, will will judge not uh, if there was a spelling mistake or there was a comma missing or question mark missing somewhere something like that i don't i don't mind about that um and uh obviously the award batches then has five points each so in this way i will be able to you know split the, the points up uh, 20 points all in all uh, and if a book does not get to the 12 points which is the first badge that I have because which would be sort of a co equivalent to a three star I, I don't want to say anything about it because I don't want to say anything negative about someone else's work because I know how heartbreaking it is for myself when someone says something negative and it's not normally not about the, the actual work itself but just the taste and if it's not my cup of tea I don't really want to review it because probably all the work is good every Body like some books and others like other books and uh, this is just my opinion so uh, uh, when I gave give 12 points which is the um, invisible cloak badge then obviously it's a good book I enjoyed it but it wasn't wowing maybe but it's still good work okay so I have the uh, the uh, the first badge so if I go through the badges the first badge is uh, the, the the invisible cloak then I have the spell wand, uh, which is obviously then 13 points. You have the grimoire, which is 14 points. So it's all you can tell it's sort of magical objects. Uh, the, the philosopher's stone is 15 points. 
then you have the unbreakable uh, sword which is 16 points then you have the uh, shooting star which then i feel is like if you had a four star but it's a little bit more so it's 17 points then you have the crystal ball which is 18 points you have the royal castle which is 19 points and then you have the magical circle which is nine, uh, uh, the 20 points so that's the the point system that i use and the badges that i award uh, the the my reviews then obviously that's sort of normally how it goes but then if i feel that i read a book that will always be my favorite book or one of my favorite books and it outdid everything and this is like the best book well obviously i'm gonna have more than one batch so it's gonna be more than but sort of in the range of my best books i've ever read i'm gonna give it an internal flame because these books because some books you might think oh i know they're gonna be good now and i'm gonna give it 20 points but maybe in the future it, i will outgrow it and it won't be it won't like hold um like especially if it's sci-fi and like the technology might be something that i know in the future maybe there's going to be even cooler stuff so maybe i don't really want to give it an internal uh, flame badge but if i think that this is going to be like always going to be one of my favorite books i'm always going to love this book even if i read it in in 15 20 years time uh so then i'm going to give it the inter um the eternal flame badge so this is sort of uh, how I work with my badges. So when, how can you, how can I, you can, might ask me, how can I then know if to give something a three or four star when I review it on other platforms? Because I can, in on the four categories, I could have a three, a three, a four, a four. Do I give it a three or a four? Well, obviously it's my review, it's how I feel. So um, then I will just sort of go by gut instinct. If I thought it was, maybe one of the categories was weak, or one of the categories would have maybe pushed it up to a, to a bit higher, then I would either give it a three or a four. So this is how I like doing it. I thought it was a fun little uh, exercise to do and I hope you enjoy it and, and will amuse you as well as, as it does uh, for me when I review my books. And uh, I hope you check out all the good reviews that I've done with all the amazing authors and all the amazing stories that I've done already on, on my website. Obviously, if you want to say anything about my badge system, good or bad, uh, you know where to leave the, the, the comment in the comment section below. Subscribe to my channel, please. And um, have an awesome day. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching. Bye.